So this week is all about improving your self-esteem. We are gonna go, we're gonna be proactive. We've sat too long on our tablets. Now we're gonna go. Climbing. Climbing. And we're saying goodbye to mama, right. who's going to Malaysia. And we're off to see my sister, who's over from New York. Hey everyone, so I've had such a fabulous weekend seeing my sister and having the kids then staying at a hotel last night and a good swim this morning um, and then i went to boxer size and for a walk and finally done some work and also massively trying to clean and tidy the house It's my weekend with the girls, yay! And I feel like rubbish um, as I've not been training recently that much. But we are gonna go, we're gonna be proactive. We've sat too long on our tablets. Now we're gonna go climbing. Climbing! So you may as well get active together. As I know, I will feel much better once I've been a bit more active as I'm feeling humongous. And my glasses are probably steamed up and I feel ugly and horrid and blah. So I'll feel better once we've been outside and done some climbing. So let's go. So this week is all about improving your self-esteem and my self-esteem. So let's get active and proactive. Can you remember where we're going climbing? Um, Climb. Um, That's it. And then we already feel a bit better after some pressure. Oh yeah, there it is. And mini, we're going to the mini no, ones. Climbing works. Mini. mini climbing works. It's good enough for me and my <coughs> hips. <coughs> and then Ari and Papa are going to meet us here in a bit, aren't Mama, they? Yeah. I, I bet I could climb at the climbing works. I bet you could. <laughs> you have to build up to that. So do I. Complicated. <laughs> you size two? Yeah. Wow. So we're going to do the pink ones. Say hello everyone! No one say hello. My vegan fishless fillets. Hey everyone, so we're back home at my mama's after climbing and a pub tea, playing the playground and some crazy dancing at home and now for this game. Is that you? Does my Is that animal you? have... Is that you, Mama? So it's Sunday, I've Is been for my morning run and we're saying goodbye to Mama, who's going to Malaysia. And we're off to see my sister, who's over from New York for the day. That was you mean that was? Because you don't know what you do. No, no, grandpa's can do it, come on. Let's do it, let's wake Gemma up. Let's wake Auntie Gemma up with a song <laughs> and embarrass her. <laughs> You'll be all right, just... Whereabouts are they? In that, In that bit. Yeah. So, should we do a big dance? The dance across the lawn to the... You know where the double doors are? Right, we'll get this song on, sweet butter side. Where are they? I hope they're, they're not naked. <laughs> she did say they'd wear pyjamas. Whereabouts are they? No, Grandpots has got a dance as well. I'm not dancing. Whereabouts are they? Let's go. Alright. Come on, Dad. You've got to add to the... Okay, come on, Dad. I'm not. <laughs> Show me, Jazz. Oh, is it way too big? <laughs> oh, if it's too big, don't embarrass. It's not embarrassed, it's just laughing. You gonna go for a pub? <laughs> pub lunch, pub play, pub growl. Let's go. What do you want? Pub lunch, soup, pub lunch, ham. The girls have got a spectacular one, haven't you? I'm jealous. And goat's cheese. Whee! Yeah, you come down. Oh. A 
be careful it's wet at the bottom. Hey everyone, so we've had one of those really randomly, spontaneously really fun days with my sister coming back, going to the pub, but we spent the whole day at the pub because the kids were playing as the bouncy castle, I was chatting, we all had a lovely time. So now we've treated, well, my sister and her partner treated us to a hotel stay at Kenwood Hall in Sheffield. So we've got a girly night, which is nice, before the girls go back to their dads tomorrow. So we're going to have, and school, so we're having a full on sleepover. No, I don't really like, but there's a boy. Well, he's not here anymore, the boy, Grey. There were boys at the pub, weren't there? There's no boys in our room. No. Right. See you all later. Actually, we've got room service first, and then we'll see you in the morning because we're going to go splish, splash, splash for a swim, aren't we? Are you? Yeah, of course I'm going for a swim. Is that Emma? Yeah. Are you? I am. Are you? Too right, girl. Me. Yeah. Okay, breakfast time. Shall we eat? It says good morning. Right, let's go swimming after a full belly. Everyone. So I've had such a fabulous weekend seeing my sister and having the kids then staying at a hotel last night and a good swim this morning um, and then I went to boxer size and for a walk and finally done some work and also massively trying to clean and tidy the house as I've got that annoying week of viewings where people come see whether they want to rent out your house and um, whilst you're still in it which is always uncomfortable um, but also because I've got a busy week and I'm moving next week. Ah, but I've packed myself up with work and social life this week, which is not good. Um, so yeah, it's a little bit stressful and I keep procrastinating, which isn't helping. But you know me, I need a deadline. Um, it's also good because I'm so busy, it's keeping my mind off tomorrow because the kids went back to their dads today and tomorrow is... Jasmine's first day of year three and Ariana's first day of school and um, so I'm going to FaceTime them in the morning as they're not with me and um, but I think I'm going to keep off social media because it's going to be a little bit painful seeing all the kind of happy families and back to school stuff unless you are of course home educating which we did explore with Jasmine, um, but she decided she wanted to go to school. So good luck on the home ed journey as well, if you're doing that. I'd love to know if you are, do comment below. Um, I do think it's fascinating. Um, and if it suits you and your family, I think it's a brilliant way to learn. Um, but yeah, so keeping busy this week because it's back to school, um, back to real life, I guess, after this kind of summer blur. But I think this summer has been even more of a blur because it's just been so difficult. Well, it was to start with and um, with all the different changes, even though that's like what I wanted. Um, but we're ending on a high because I've got somewhere to live and a moving house. Um, so whilst this summer has been a huge challenge full of new challenges, a lot of challenges and dramas but I feel like we are ending on a high.